Oh no. Lucinda, run! No way in! Suspended in ice, but it might not last as long as I'd like. Come on, let's go. I'm sorry, Caitlin. <laughs> Nana, are you all right? <sighs> we don't have much. I... <laughs> uh, half now. I'm fine. I'm fine. I just got thrown around a little, that's all. Uh, that's an understatement. You can't push yourself too much. I'll be fine. Keep pressure on it. You know that. <laughs> yeah. You'll be okay. How long is that ice going to hold Caitlin? For a while, hopefully. The duration of an entrapment spell is usually determined by the strength of the person behind held. I haven't used that spell since... If Caitlin is like this, then Gareth... Zane, we know how it feels. How it felt. Not being able to do anything? Being trapped in your own mind? They're still in there. They can hear us. We know the pain all too well. Even so, seeing Caitlin like that just tears me apart. Trust me, it's even worse face to face with her. But the Caitlin we know and love is still in there somewhere. There has to be a way to revert them back to their normal selves. I have no recollection. He only searched for ways to make the potion stronger, not ways to weaken them. Terry... How was he trying to strengthen them? I don't recall completely. Why would you... <sighs> From what I remember, he continually searched for lesser ingredients that would eliminate weaker emotions within the host. What do you mean by weaker emotions? Emotions that he didn't want them to feel. Like love. We need to start searching. We need to find Aaron. We can figure out what to do about Caitlyn and Garth after we find him. I wouldn't know where to begin. This place is massive. This is nothing like... There's a strange energy resonating from everywhere. It's making it impossible to sense where people are. At the very least, we know we need to head towards the city. Emily! 
Alan, hurry! We don't have much time! He's going to use it on Alina! Where do we need to go and how do we turn it off? I... I... I don't know! Emelyn, please. We need to find her. I can't lose her too. Please, Emelyn! Emelyn! Ghost? 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 Hey, hello? Are you okay? <gasps> Are you alright? You just started staring off. I've been here before. I think I know where they took Aaron. What? How? Last time I was here, I was in that room. They took him to the room at the bottom of the cannon. The one with the giant crystal. Alright, let's think about this. If she knows where Eren is, then you should head there as soon as possible. Ghost, can you take her? G uh, yeah. I can do that. I'm going to. I remember a room with a giant crystal. Maybe I can help. Lucinda, I think I have an idea. Mind staying here to help with Caitlin? We'll need to keep that spell on her. Was already a thought in my mind. Let's see how strong little Miss Sugar Pea actually is. Good. I'm going to stay here with not Kawaii chan I just want to make sure he's safe. What about you? We'll be fine, Aphmau. She needs to rest. Her wound is still recovering, and I want to make sure she's alright. Besides, Lucinda could use someone watching her back. I'm sure I would be fine, but I do appreciate the offer. What about Travis? I... don't know. What can we do? Once we make sure we have everyone else safe, then we'll save him. We have to. All right. I trust you, Ghost. Let's go. Hmm. the last time I'll ask. What is this place? Answer me! I don't know. Who is in charge? I don't know. Then tell me, what are you doing here? You are no longer my superior. You're with the enemy. You're a weak-minded... <coughs> Waste of time. Whoa, whoa. Let's not do anything rash now. Why are you locked up? To protect me from random people pointing rifles at me. Funny guy. Sounds like you haven't been changed like them. Who are you? Just an old vet. I'm not with them. Your eyes. 
They'll be the last thing you see if you don't start giving answers. The color. They remind me of someone I once met. You're one of Marcio's boys. Th that was the name of my grandfather. He was with the Guardian forces. And judging by the way you hold that rifle, I'd say you followed in his footsteps. Who are you? My name is Rowan Eisen, and like I said, I'm a retired vet. The Guardian forces brought me here with Derek Lycan. Lycan? If you're here, then I imagine you already have some vague understanding of what's going on. I am not your enemy. Even if that's true, I cannot let you leave. Tell me, what do you think is going on out there? Something is controlling the rest of the Guardian forces, and they're being used to operate this place. I intend to find out who's doing this. <laughs> so determined. Tell me, kid, what's your rank? Captain. What? You were in command of all of them? Then you already know who it is. What do you mean? Derek has been hiding his family for his entire life. Do you really think he just slipped up one day and that's why you're here? You and your battalion were brought here on purpose. This place is why you're here, and the same for us. The Guardian forces and the Lycans were manipulated by the same man. <sighs> This device, it turns people into objects of power. They called them relics. Derek has already been turned into one, and Michael intends to turn Aaron into a relic as well. I heard the reports. Why should I care if that monster is removed from the face of this earth? He's already took the life of so many innocent people. His entire family deserves this. I've known the Lycans for longer than you've been alive. This would have never happened if the Guardian forces weren't hunting Derek and Aaron. They're Ultimas! They're dangerous to everyone! Why? Because of the sin of Derek's father? Should they be punished for something they never did? And look what happened! That's because you killed his entire family before his eyes. What would you do if someone destroyed everything you cared about in less than a day? What? We didn't... Sir! She's... She was unarmed! We're supposed to take them alive! Sir, he's getting away. Forget him! Get the paramedic! Forget Aaron Lycan. Sir, he's the reason we're here. Follow! My orders! Breathe. Please. Who killed who first? What did you think was going to happen? But she's... You were so obsessed with hunting Aaron that you failed to realize the real monster right in front of you. We can still do something. Michael is somewhere here. Fine, let's go. Do you know your way around? Somewhat. I think we should... Please. Is someone else here with you? Not that I know of. He's bleeding! <laughs> We're in the heavens. <laughs> He's planning. Looks like they did a number on him. 
he plans to activate it. <laughs> it will take everyone. What is he talking about? Anyone below the cannon is in grave danger. Calm down. Control your breathing. Explain what you're talking about. The Celestial Cannon. Its purpose is to protect the world from celestial objects that would threaten it. But it needs power in order to operate. Its power relies on the souls of every living being below the cannon. It uses souls to cultivate them into a greater essence. It transforms them into power. Wait, does that... Every soul below will be pulled in. We need to stop that demon here and now. This is the air impression. He's gonna turn into a sexy girl right now. Ah! Pop twist! I was Aaron all along! And you can be too with your very own Aaron hoodie, ears, and plush. Once he's sold out, he'll be gone forever, so make sure you check him out so you can make out with him. I don't want this! No! And just as a note, a serious note. And once they are sold out, they are sold out for good, meaning that we will never have them in the shop ever again. Anyway, be sure to check it out in the description down below. Hope you guys enjoy the show. Bye! This entire situation is a complete mess. Years of planning foiled when you decided to try and be a father. So much planning. Wasted! <laughs> no matter. It just seems like I'll have to do things the hard way. Doesn't matter how hard you fight it, I will make you obey. Sir, the damage sections have repaired themselves and preparations have been completed. We should be ready. Are you sure you will be able to withstand? I wouldn't have been able to before. But now, thanks to my friend. Derek, I can. Activate the Aethrical Array. Ready at your command. <laughs> Sir? Is everything okay? I won't let you hurt anyone else! You forget your place! I don't care! You won't hurt anyone else! Pathetic. I've grown tired of your interruptions. Don't you see? There is absolutely nothing you can do. Your consciousness belongs to me. I don't care. I won't give up.
Michael's work. I vaguely remember this. So, it wasn't from Aaron? No. He was battling someone else. This is the prototype room, where people are consumed to make relics. And... it... it... it was activated recently. What does that mean? I... I... I think they already... took Aaron. Please, just listen to me! If you don't release me, then as soon as I'm free, I'm going to throw you off this cannon! No, please! This is for your own good! Someone else is controlling your body, and I know you're still in there! <laughs> you really think I'd let her out? Or even see the light of day? She's gone. You'll be next! You don't care about us? Your friends? We came here for you! I never cared about you! I never cared about anyone! The moment I'm released, I'm going to send you falling to your death! Caitlin! Zane, I'll be fine. You need to go. You need to help them. I'll stay here. But you need help. Please, they need you. I won't be far. If anything happens, I'll be here.
must be positioning himself between the flow of souls and the crystal. If so, he'll be just up ahead. The celestial cannon was meant as a weapon for protection. Life would not exist here today without it. But I should have destroyed it long ago. Hang in there, old man. Almost there. Enough! I've been waiting too long for this, and I'm not about to let some weak excuse for a demon to try to stop me. I've already had enough of you always trying to get in my way. Fire. You're too late.